In this video, I will set up the Volson Smart Plug with my Alexa and Google Home devices. This is your reminder to please put your Alexa and Google Home devices on mute as I will be using the wake word frequently during this video. So let's get started. Hey Google, turn test plug on. Sure, turning on the test plug. Alexa, turn off test plug. Alexa, turn on test plug. Hey Google, turn off test plug. Okay, turning the test plug off. And here is the unboxing of the Volston Smart Plug. And let's see, open it up. And I see the literature right on top here and the instructions, lots of pictures, very good. Uh, safety notes right here. And I got two plugs in this package here. So I'll take one out. There's nothing else in the box. So let me take out this smart plug. And let's see, it is a three prong smart plug. And there's a small button right here on the front is how you manually turn it off and on. This is not a paid endorsement. I did receive this plug uh, at no charge for the purposes of making this setup video. Let's get started with the setup now. So there are instructions right here in this little pamphlet. First of all, I'm going to the Play Store and, and I'm going to search for the VE Sync app. And, it's gonna, and I don't have it on my smartphone yet, so I'm going to hit Install. And I'm going to accept Terms and Conditions. And here we go. I'm installing it right now and I'm going to hit open and I need to create a login so I'm going to hit sign up I'm going to enter in my email address and a password and I'm going to agree to terms of use and privacy policy and I'm going to hit sign up and my registration was successful so I need to follow the instructions to complete the sign up open that email now thanks for joining vSync and I'm going to verify my email address and I'm going to hit verify my email address and it says, congratulations, my account has been verified. Excellent. So let's go back to the vSync app right here. And I'm going to hit continue. And I don't have any devices. This is my first device. So I do need to add my first device now. So I do need to plug it in. So I'm going to plug it in right now. Let's see. So I've got this. And then this is the actual lamp right here I'm going to plug in. Let's get this all done. And let's see. Let's see if this is on. All right, the plug, the lamp is on. Okay, I'm going to turn it off now. And I'm going to hit add your first device. And it gives me a choice. I'm going to choose Wi-Fi outlet. And then, see, my outlet looks like the top one here. So I'm going to select that one. And it says plug your smart outlet into the wall. I've done that. And now I'm going to hit start setup. Okay, press and hold the power button for five seconds until the light turns blue or purple. The light is blue now. I'm going to hit next. And now I'm going to join my network. And it's attempting to connect. Let's see if this works. Ah, and here it is. It is, uh, it has found my device. And it says I need to give it a name. So the default name is XCity Wi-Fi Outlet USCA1. That's probably not a good name for it. So let's edit that. Uh, let's name it Test Lamp. Test Lamp. I'm going to hit OK. And my smart outlet is now set up. And I'm going to hit Done. And I would continue going through this process to add more outlets to this app here. So let's see if this works now. I'm going to hit test lamp and I'm gonna, it's off. I'm going to turn on. Oh, and here we go. So from the app, it's now working off, on, and off. Okay, so perfect. So it works perfectly with the app. So now let's get started uh, with Alexa and Google Home as that's probably what you're most interested in. All right, so I'm going to get out of this app right here and I'm going to go into my Amazon Alexa app here. As I pull up my app here, it goes into home and then I'm going to hit the menu button, the top three bars in the top left hand corner here and then I'm going to select smart home and I've got lots of smart home devices here. I'm going to hit, I'm going to scroll all the way down to smart home skills. I'm going to select smart home, I'm going to enable smart home skills. And I do need to select the correct smart home skill that corresponds to this outlet, VE Sync, V E S Y N C. All right, here it just found V Sync, V E Sync immediately. I'm going to hit enable. Then I need to type in the login and password I just created. 
And we're gonna hit authorize, and oh, voila, VSync has been successfully linked. And now it is discovering my device. So I'm gonna take it off mute, so I'm ready to go when this thing pairs to my Echo. Alexa, turn test plug on. There it goes. Alexa, turn test plug off. And now we've got it working with our Alexa device. Yay! Now let's do the same thing with Google Home. And so we're in the home. I'm going to hit the menu button, the top left-hand corner, the three bars. I'm gonna select home control. I'm gonna hit the plus button in the bottom right-hand corner. And then I'm gonna add devices. And I'm gonna hit search. And I'm gonna search for VE Sync. And it comes right up, VE Sync. Right here, I'm gonna to have to log in again. And I'm gonna type in my login and password. I'm gonna hit authorize. Oh, and sure enough, test plug comes right on. I'm gonna hit done and I'm gonna hit got it. And let's see if this works. Okay, Google, tur turn test plug on. You got it, turning on the test plug. Hey, Google, turn test plug off. Sure, turning the test plug off. And there it is. We have our Volston smart plug now working with our Alexa and Google Home devices. And I hope you found this informative. I hope you'll try this at home. I will link to everything below. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Bye now.